So he's number 11. Calvin Tatum goes into gate number one in red. Paul Thorpe is in blue. Andy Smith in white and Joe Screen in yellow and black. Thorpe and beaten on six points and Tatum, Smith and Screen all on four points. That's the way they line up across the gate for gate number 11. Tapes now rise and away they go sweetly into the first turn and it's a rider in white who is Andy Smith who's got pole position. Andy Smith with Calvin Tatum tucked in behind him. So Smith leads. Tatum second. The blue helmet colour of fourth off who's unbeaten before this race is in third place. But it's Smith who leads. Now Tatum getting closer by the meter. Smith just. Tatum second. Fourth third. Green fourth in that order. Two laps gone. Can Tatum come from the back? He's trying the inside line on Andy Smith. Going down the back straight. Bill Smith leads. Tatum now trying the inside through. Has he got the pace to come from the back? Smith slides out wide with one more lap to go. Smith still leads. Now Tatum for his opponent comes up the inside. Has Tatum got it now? Tatum moves sweetly underneath Andy Smith. Magnificent manoeuvre by the previous British champion. But who's going to get there? It's going to be a race to life. It's just Tatum who gets there. Only just on the line. But what a great race. Tatum punches the air with delight. Andy Smith has to be content with second place. And his third place in all that fabulous action was Paul Thorpe. So Joe Screen fed in the score. But Calvin Tatum really was a great manoeuvre. Down the back straight and round. The final two, but, uh, sorry, third and fourth band, it was round the outside line, then fought his opponent and drifted up the inside so, so sweetly as Andy Smith went out to block it. What he thought was his outside manoeuvre. And just look from there on, Andy Smith was totally foxed as Calvin Tatum 